Hey guys, it's Meredith, and I'm going to be showing you how to remove and count scripts on your avatar. I will be using the Phoenix Viewer, which means that not everything I do is available on other viewers, but I will warn you if that, whenever we come to that. So I'm going to start off by showing you how to count the scripts on your entire SL avatar. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to select a part on my body that has no sculpts, and I'm going to go to S count. Now this is typically used on a Phoenix viewer. I'm not sure if other viewers have this option. Um, I've been told that a lot of them don't. But you can buy script counters that are for free and get them passed to you. But for the Phoenix viewer, right click, script count, and I have 381 scripts. Now, in most Goreen Sims, you are not going to be allowed to have over 100 scripts. And my goal today is to bring my avatar down to 40 scripts or lower. So, I'm going to start with the HUDs and the AOs. And if you're in an RP sim, you're going to have your, of course, your RPing meter or HUD. And here I have the GM meter, which is, I believe, about three scripts. Yes, it is. It's three scripts. You're going to have to have that one on. So, you know, that those three scripts are going to have something that you have to budget for, but if you're in an RP sim, you're probably going to have a lot of weapons. I actually have two weapons on myself. A lot of men have complained about, you know, how scripted weapons are. If you get Primus, you do not need this HUD. You can hotkey your weapons, you can hotkey pretty much all your stances, so we do not need that. Real quick, we'll see what the script count on that. That's another three scripts that we don't need. So we'll delete that. Um, for AOs, I have a lot of different AOs. I've noticed that Oracle has the least amount of scripts. Um, they have about three scripts each. Right now I'm wearing a Vista, and I believe that has nine whole scripts. Let's see here. Script count. Oh, it has 16. Well, there you go. See, so it has a lot of scripts. Um, I really love my AOs though, so I always budget for having a lot of scripts on my AO. And so I'm going to leave it like that, but a good suggestion for lower scripted AOs is Oracle. Now to count the scripts on a single sculpty instead of your entire avatar, you need to right click it, more, S count. Now my Katwa hair, which Katwa is always heavy on the scripts, so my um, suggestion is to resize your hair the moment you get it and then delete the scripts and always try to keep a boxed copy of you know of all the items you purchase in case you do change your avatar shape because once the scripts are deleted there's no way in getting them back thankfully I do have a copy of this so I'm going to click it and remove scripts. Now, not all menus will have the delete scripts or remove scripts right on the front, but thankfully, Katwa does. So let's see. And we went from 192 scripts to zero. Sometimes whenever you remove scripts, they're not all gonna remove. So thankfully, this one does. So if I go to my skirt, it's gonna have a menu pop up as well but this one doesn't have the remove scripts right on the front. Go to the all prims. You see these percentages and then the options, rotation, position, and more. Sometimes it has options, sometimes it has other, click on those. Then you'll see save, default, and delete. Um, oh, wait, let's see here, delete and it'll ask, are you sure you want to delete it? Yes, we're sure. So we're going to delete that. And I'm going to go and do that to all of my pieces on my dress real quick. If you notice, I have a lot of little sculpties added onto my dress. Um, so I'm going to have to make sure that I grab all of those. Pretty much anything that you're buying from a clothing creator is going to have resized scripts these days. Um, it makes it so that they don't have to make the outfit modifiable, but you it can fit any avatar. And a lot of creators actually do not realize that you don't need a lot of scripts to resize outfits. Um, 
Some put a resizing script in every single prim, and that is why some outfits are so script heavy. Thankfully, TWA, the White Armory, which is what I'm wearing right now, does n is not heavy on scripts, and it doesn't take up too many. Still, I always try to delete them. Now, back to my weapons. If you notice, I have my sheath on. Now, sheaths also have resizing scripts, and I'm not sure that everyone knows that. If you click on them, they have an option for the dagger, and they have an option for the whip, which is going to resize the dagger and the whip. And then there's the resizer for the entire sheath. Click that, all prims, more, delete, and delete it. So that should have taken away a good amount of prims. Now I'm going to check real quick how many, how many scripts I have left. And I'm down to 40 scripts already, but like I said, I want to try to get under 40 today. So I'm going to look to my veil. Now, I know for a fact that this veil does not have a delete option up here in the menu. But since I have the Phoenix Viewer and since this veil is modifiable, instead of using a menu, I can select it, edit, go up to the Tools option for the Phoenix Viewer, and right here at the very bottom of this menu, it says Remove Scripts and Selection. I'm going to click that. It's going to tell me to wait. Let's see here. It removed four scripts. So, my script count on my avatar is now 36 scripts, which is much lower than the 381 scripts that we started out with. I hope that this helped you in learning how to remove scripts from your avatar. And if you have any questions, please IM me. My name is Meredith Tremont on SL. Thank you very much.